I'm here with Inga Hebrecht, the Vice President of Responsible Business for Carlson Residor. Now, this isn't a job title that we typically get to the Hotel Investment Conference, and the reason being is that we've obviously just been working on a couple of sessions that are green-focused. Um, yeah. We've just come out from a green workshop. Now, mm -hmm. why is this so important for the African market in particular and uh, the hotel sector? Well, first, let me say that I'm very excited to be here and to have the topic on the agenda. Yeah. Um, tourism is growing in emerging markets in Africa. We have a huge pipeline as Carlson Residor, and we need to make sure that we develop those hotels in a green way. Yeah. And we need to make sure that we are in from the beginning, because that's where we can really make a difference. Now, forgive me for being, playing devil's advocate, but when people say hear the words green or sustainable, mm. Um, people tend to sort of roll their eyes a bit and think that where's the business case behind this. Um, today's session was really about the numbers. Um, mm. Tell us a little bit about the EDGE program that the IFC are running and why it's so important. Well, EDGE is a free tool to do modelling of ecological solutions yeah. and it's a certification for very good buildings that meet mm -hmm. certain standards. And we have seen with our projects that um, the tool proves that environmental investments do have a good business case yeah. and they have a very short return on investment, usually below two years. This is something which I guess the industry doesn't tend to understand. This is, this is the audience that we yeah. need to reach because this is where the potential is and usually yeah. I'm talking in our hotels about retrofitting as an operator mm -hmm. uh, but we need to tackle the buildings as well and that's why it's exciting to talk to all the developers and investors, investors who are here. So interestingly from the session today it was more of a how-to. Mm -hmm. uh, tell us some of the challenges that came out that, from that particular discussion. What were some of people in the audience drawing attention to? Well, I think there was a lot of excitement in the audience and there was a good pickup of the message and of what the Edge tool means. Yeah, um, yeah there was a, a couple of questions on the details of the tool, but I think the general overview was that and the general impression was very positive. Uh, I agree. And later you're going to be talking on the why. Why mm -hmm. would you do this? Um, outside of just brand impact, why would actually uh, developers in Africa take the opportunity to develop in a sustainable way. Yeah. You mentioned the business case because there is a clear business case but also it's a matter of risk mitigation I think and increasing the assets value. Okay. Well thank you Inga and I look forward to working with you in the future. Same here. Thank you Matt. Thank you.